Hey everybody, and welcome to The Sims 2, and to uh, what we're going to call a new series with The Sims 2. Um, our previous one with uh, with Mr. Nook uh, involved building a town. We started with nothing, and we we have built, I think it's safe to say, it's safe to call this a town. Um, it's Of course, there's more we can do to it, but, but I call it a town. And we have, I was going to add it up, and I forgot, I think we have 33... Uh, uh, citizens in in the fine town of Nookstone. Uh, Thirty of them are viewers. Three of them I created myself. But uh, there's always room for more, of course. But I think I, I thought this was a nice defining point in uh, between series. The last the last series built a town. Mr. Nook ran off to college. He is now returned to the town. Met up back up with Buford, and uh, we have. I think a bustling city. I guess we could give a little tour of the town uh, while we're at it here. We kind of have a bit of a downtown area here. With uh, we have Bill's Museum here, and we have flowers, furniture, some some electronics store. Our first, what was our first one? Was it the library? I think it might have been the library. Was the first one we did. We have a toy store over here. Oh, I got mountains kind of in the way. Get out of the way, mountains. Um, Lila's shop. That was a pretty early one. And we have the uh, Nook Square. Oh, yeah, way mountains. And uh, we have uh, Jay Stank's bar over here at the Space Bar. We have McDonald's. That's right, McDonald's is in here. And uh, put the saloon. Right, right. And uh, I, mean, I think I mentioned Town Hall. We have Kazak's Tracks, a recording studio. One of our first families. Actually, we had um, the, the Pioneer House was our first one with the uh, the farm. We'll get a whole. We'll, we'll deal with that one next time. Uh, we have the circus family over here. We can do with as well. So we just we'll play a rotation. Um, I think it's um, I wanted to do. Let's see. Where's my season? Season? Seasons? There. We're gonna call it. We're gonna make everything fall. We're gonna follow the uh, the real seasons. Whoops. That's not the button I want to hit. Buttons. Buttons. There we go. So what we're gonna do is uh, follow the well the northern hemisphere seasons, anyways. So. Uh, for the next couple months, it's going to be fall. I, I anticipate this will be a, a long-lasting series. We uh, made, what, 50 episodes for um, phase one of uh, of this Let's Play. So I can see this going on for quite a while. Um, but yeah, so that's that's the town. Um, I have a couple castles back here. We have a pirate ship, of course. Uh, the aliens live over here uh, at the, the uh, spaceship. But for this episode, we're going to meet up with Mr. Nook. Mr. Nook is back. From college, he is. He has returned from Lafayette Tech, physics major, Mr. Nook, and he's no longer a camper. He is now living in uh, a, a home of his own. So let's go say hey to uh, Bruce and Buford Nook. So uh, we, we, I did get rid of the the glitter and the sparkles from Mr. Nook, so he's he's still green. That's okay, I suppose, but no more sparkles. They were a little bit annoying. Yeah, so Mr. Nook has finally returned. He's met up with Buford. It's an exciting day. He still has his white glow here. So we have to give a bit of a story on, on what's happening here. So Mr. Nook returns from college. And um, he, he goes on a bit of a spending spree, as any sensible college kid would do. He bought himself a new car. He, uh, he, I mean, he got the necessity. He's got a car. He's got a nice computer. he got a nice TV. Um, his life as a physics major, major he would be um, doing a lot of robot building. And selling those, so that's of course a, a priority. Um, he decided, um, you know what? He decided oh, I'm a physics major. I don't need to have someone else build a house for me. I build my own house. So he uh, scavenged up some aluminum planks. What do you call aluminum? Aluminum sheets, and uh, made himself a uh, a house in the shape of a spaceship. Because that's how Mr. Nook rolls. And uh, for the roof, he didn't know much about roofs, so he figured the grass works, right? It worked for. Thousands of years. Why can't it work now? So yeah, so there's Mr. Nook's house. It's <laughs> it's a quick tour. Uh, we have a bit of an outhouse here, and we have a little sink. Uh, Kitty's litter box. Is that? Oh, that's a that's a litter box. Yeah, it's over here and scratching pad. We do have our our tomatoes. Will be back, Mr. Nook and his infamous Nookstone tomatoes. We're in, we're going all tomatoes because that's what we do. The Nook the Nook brand tomatoes. Everyone knows about those. Hey, Paper Boy's here. So yeah, we did buy a car. Um, <laughs> we don't need a car because we have a broom, but you know what? That's just the way we roll. Yeah, so yeah, we are a warlock. Oh, you know, speaking of, we have... Where are they? Where are they? 
We have um, our spell casting thing. Should I put it here? Is that is that enough space? We'll do that. And we need our um, this thing. That's big. It's going to have to go outside. We'll just plop it over here. Well, we'll keep it away from the, the tomatoes. We don't want to. We don't want to spoil the tomatoes with. Oops. What did I do? What did I do? What did I grab? What is this? Oh, I don't. No, 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 no. You get back. Uh, you go over here and you get back. Uh, back in inventory is I. Okay. Ooh, it's all boiling over. So, uh, yeah, this is our house. So the idea here, what we're gonna do with Mr. Nook is we're going to, as you can see, we don't have floors either. So we don't, we, you know, floors are for fancy people. We're not fancy. We don't need floors. We're a warlock. We don't need floors. Um, we'll, we'll later come to the conclusion that we do need floors. But, uh, not just yet. But the plan is here, we're going to, we start with three grand, but we're going to, uh, become the greatest robot manufacturer in the, in the all of Nookstone. Which I suppose I was going to call this Nookstone Nation. Maybe we should have some sort of, a. Uh, we're our own nation. Maybe we need to come up. That gives me some ideas for buildings to make. We can do like uh, uh, we have a town hall, but we need like a police station, fire department. There's a lot of things we can do in here. Uh, we're going to. What are we doing? What's your plan, Mr. Nook? What is your plan? You want to BFF with Marissa? BFF with you? Just want to talk to friends? You want to get a job in the head? Nope, that's not gonna happen. Nope. You want to gain a cooking skill point and logic? Yeah, that is an idea. You know what I want to do though is I want to. Make some reagents. We need to get your spell casting under control. Actually, what we probably should do is we probably should make some robots. We probably could use some money. Because our first robots are going to be terrible. So that's an idea. Nikki. Nikki Zhang, who are you? I don't think I've ever seen you before. Don't mind me, I'm just cackling over here making my stuff. Oh, feed. Feed Buford. Go feed Buford. We spent uh, four years away from Buford. We're finally back, though. Can he fit in here? Can you go in there? What are you thinking? You're going to go sit on the counter. Can you get in here? I can't tell you what to do. I don't know if he's going to fit in there. I might have to rearrange some things. We talked about the mis this, Mr. Nook. Don't do that anymore. All right, we're going to go pee. And uh, you know what? Uh, we're not really hungry. What can we make, though? Oh, I can stock things. I can, can't I? Yeah, stock it. Because we bought some groceries while we were in college. What is this? Oh, yeah, my poster. Wait. No, it's a magazine. I did make a poster, didn't I? This is another magazine. We have that. Uh, my, my diploma. Yes, that has to go on the wall. And, uh, put it over, uh, over the cat's food bowl. Apparently, I never took my painting. I guess I didn't take my painting, did I? I left it in my dorm room. Oh, bummer. I hope the next guy enjoys it. We need to water all these things. Water your plants. Um, yeah, just move them all over there. There you go. We live on tomatoes. Tomatoes and what was it? <laughs> what were those? Pears? I don't know what those other ones were. Oh, we got some visitors meeting. Oh, hey. Everyone's like, oh, hey, look. The Nook is back. Elise is here. Crystal. Thomas Murphy. I don't know who you are, Thomas. Did you greet? Yeah, greet, greet Crystal. Greet Elise. Greet everyone while you're at it. You guys like my car? What do you think? Huh? I'm not sure what change owner means. I can give it to nobody. I wish I could give it to Buford. That would be hilarious. Oh, good. It does work. I was worried this wouldn't work. But yes, you can sit on the cat cot, watch some TV. Yeah. What are you mad about? What are you mad about? You're mad about something. You're mad about... Oh, because you want to sit. But you can't because this is in the way. Uh, Where can this go? You know, this house is almost kind of tiny. There we go. You know what? This really, house really isn't made for three people. What are you whining about? What's wrong with you? I don't mind me. I'm going to make my first toy robot. Yes, it's hilarious. First toy robot. We're going to name this one. Oh, man. we got to name it something. Um, um, we're going to call it Bruce Bot. Uh, we got to spell Bruce right, though. Bruce Bot. And we're going to make him a red guy. First robot. They're paying $100 for this hunk of. Alabaster? <laughs> We're making robots out of it. Yeah, everyone, what do you think? I'm not sure where the power comes from. I should have put a solar panel out there. I need to do that. 
Solar panels are, where are solar panels? Uh, miscellaneous, maybe? I know they're in here. Not just a community lot thing, are they? we got to find them, because that, that would you know, kind of fill everything in. We're not tied up to the grid. We're a physics major. We don't tie in the grids. Uh, no, no, nothing there. Where would it be? Decoration? Maybe in... It's going to be miscellaneous. Is it solar panel? Is that a miscellaneous decoration? Is that what those are? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't, maybe I should look for this. Oh, here we go. Found it. 600 bucks. We can get the big one. 1200 bucks. Do, do we want to... Uh, yeah, do it. Let's park that one uh, right over... Well, that's in the trees. Let's set it like right. Right there. There we go. Now we're hooked up to the Now you can watch TV good. Elise is on the computer. Yeah, I haven't gotten my computer yet. Elise? Trees, now what do you want? You want to... Oh, you're going to toss him in the air. He's going to toss you in the air. Someone's going to toss you in the air. You heard. I'm in the way now. Because I'm using this. You know what? This house is not made for more people. I should put another door in here. I could put a door back here. That would ruin my window. But yeah, this kind of takes up more space. So this house is kind of terribly built. Wait, that's the idea. This is a terribly built house built by a physics major. Everyone's stuck in here. Well, you know what? You shouldn't have come over then. I didn't invite you over. You just showed up. Who invited you? Nobody. Oh, oh. Finish the Bruce bot. It's there. Nice. Excellent. I want to see the bruise pot. We gotta put it somewhere. We don't have a shelf or anything, do we? We don't have a shelf. Well, we can set it on the floor. We can set it on the floor that... Here, you know what? It's gonna, it's gonna guard our outside. There we go. It's like, a, it's like a lawn gnome. But it's a robot. What can we do with it? Forget we can... We can, can we tinker? Well, let's play with it first. Let's see what it does. He just turns on. Tinker with it. Make it better. There you go. There you go. Show these people in your house what a physics major can do with a robot. Did you do anything? Hmm. Alright. Well, you know what we can do? Is... Uh, hey there, Phil. With a weird last name. Um, turn it on. Yes. Leave it on. Let it stay on. Um, we can do some of this. We could probably travel somewhere. So we need to get. A, we need to buy a bed, right? This camp cot is only so comfy. I mean, I guess it's it's okay to watch TV with, but we're gonna buy a bed. So let's travel. Hey there, Sarah. Uh, we're going to go somewhere. Um, Buford, do you want to come? Yeah, come on, Buford. Let's go. So we're gonna go to where is it? Nookstone Furniture. That's where we're going to go. We're going to go buy a bed. I'm stuck. People are in my way. Get out of my way. Now let's go for a spin. Buford, you want to drive? Four years since I saw that cat. Like old times. Where are you going, Buford? No, car's over here. He was going to walk. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I don't think I've ever owned a car in this game. Because who spends $11,000 on this thing? <laughs> well, I do. <laughs> so yeah, let's go buy a bed. Let's go try. I've I built these uh like all these businesses I have built, but I've I have visited very few of them. So uh, this will be inter entertaining, maybe. We can buy a bed. We're gonna take things slow because you know we don't have a lot of money, and we built a robot that cost us a hundred dollars. So we'll buy a a cheap bed. It may be even worse than our camp cot, though. Well, I don't know. I'd buy, you know, like a couch or something, but ain't no way that's going to my house. Uh, so, all right, here we go. We are in Nookstone Furniture. We've got Adrian. Elliot is here. Hunter is here. I was right. Shirtless Hunter, Hunter is running the cash register. What are you guys doing? Um, I'll, I'll say hey. Hey, you guys know me? The town is named after me. I just graduated from college. This town that you live in, I was the sole uh, liver. Liver. I was, I was the sole resident of this town, uh, just you know, not that long ago. And then all you people moved in, and I don't have beds here, do I? I don't have, I don't have beds here. Why am I dying? 
No, we didn't. I meant. Did I say bed? I didn't mean bed. I meant something else. Uh, let's buy a new chair. So we have. Um, is that a smart purchase? No, not at all. But we're gonna do it. Is there anything else here that we could do? This guy, five hundred bucks. That might be worth it. A globe. We could buy a light. You know what? That would be an excellent purchase. That would be a smart purchase, Mr. Milk. Let's do that. Um, I want one that hangs from the ceiling. So we, we've got this one here we can pick out. We got this. This guy looks kind of nice. Uh, this crooked guy looks a little, uh, a little too fancy for me. Um, does that fit into the, the look of a, a metal shack with the uh, factory? Uh, the big ball. Um, I like to buy a toilet. Can I buy a toilet? <laughs> I should use this. Use this toilet while you're here, Mr. Nook. You don't have a, It's like when you go camping, you know, when you find a nice bathroom, you use that bathroom. Because you don't want to go back to the campsite. We've all been in a pit toilet before. See, there's a lot of things I can use here. When I get money eventually, I'll have to expand walls, of course. We'll build on new rooms to our house. Maybe one of these days we'll build it out of something other than aluminum. I don't know. Maybe we'll get there. It depends on how well our robots sell, I suppose. I could go get a bite to eat, too. So, you know what? Let's, let's, um, you know, this is Explore the Town Day. This is the town that I made, or I was the first one in. Um, I kind of like, I kind of, you know, oh, you bought the thing I was going to buy. I was going to buy that. Um, this one's okay. $200. This one's only $15. Alright, we're buying the $15 one. What's Buford doing? What are you doing? You're hanging outside by the car. Alright, guard that car. Yeah, don't let anybody steal that. This is the only car in Nookstone. So you watch it. Somebody peed next to it. Is that you? Did you pee next to it? I don't know about you, Buford. What am I doing? Don't, don't, don't touch her, don't, don't touch her there. <laughs> buy the light. Yes, go buy the light. Uh, what's he doing? Go pay for your items. Some strange things going on up there. Why is it so dark in here? Turn the lights on. How much are these? $155 for one of those? Yeah, I'll take my $15 light. And then we're going to go eat somewhere. We've got McDonald's we can eat at. We've got, uh, um, um, <laughs> what else do we have? I'm sure we have more things. I have forgotten. What else do we have here? I don't know. We have the bowling alley. It has food. The arcade has food. We can go eat at the arcade. Maybe we'll do that. I was going to redesign the arcade a little bit and make it less of a restaurant and more of an arcade, but, you know, it might work. Come on, Hunter. Push those buttons faster. I'm just a kid without a shirt. I like to buy my items. It's only fifteen dollars. It's not that many buttons you have to push. push the buttons. There you go. Thank you. All right, I have bought my light, and now Buford and I are going to drive to another lot because we're going to go eat. Because it is uh, seven p.m. It's time to eat. We want to go. So here we can we we can go to Bakeru is a is a bakery. We have McDonald's, of course. Um, the bar. Which we can eat, I guess, peanuts. Yeah, tear from the arcade. Okay, so we're going to go to the arcade. Grab a bite to eat. They have pizza there, right? No, this is a very... It's right here, actually. Can I just walk to there? No, we're driving there. We have this fancy car. We're not walking. We can also use our broom, of course. But you know what? We're going to fit into the town. We're just some random green guy walking around that, you know, has the town's name. Beaver, are you going to get in the car? No, I'd appreciate it if you came along. Come on, there we go. All right, so let's load it up. We're going to have some, uh, I think, so when I made this um, arcade, the idea was the restaurant part of it would have uh, things like pizza, hot dogs, hamburgers, you know, arcade kind of food, Chuck E. Cheese kind of food. Uh, but apparently I, I took off the list the things that I want to put on the list. So this arcade is a little bit fancier because it serves like, you know, filet mignon and, and, uh, re, uh, what was it? What else was in there? I don't know. Some like wild salmon. <laughs> this is a fancy, fancy arcade. Oh, right. And everyone wears, that's right. Everyone wears, I fit in right here just perfectly. Everyone wears the, uh, <laughs> the, the witch hats. Uh, so this is Silencer's place. There he is. He's playing the games. He's, Making sure they work okay. 
So, Marilina. Oh, right. I have to pay. Right. This is a, an expensive place. You have to pay the ticket machine to go to walk him in here. Just to walk in the the, the arcade, you have to pay to get in. And then you have to pay to be seated to eat. Hey, Sandy. Okay. I would like to eat. Me and my cat would like to eat. Where's my cat? Are you guarding the car again, Buford? Yes? Watch that Peter guy. I don't trust him. Him and his cat pants. Hey there, Mayalina. You got some... Oh, yes. Yes. You got some fancy hat. I like your hat. It's got a little bit... You can tell it's a new hat because once you uh, wear them a little bit, they get a little bit of a... Less pointy. All right. We want... There he is. Darren. The chef's choice. Oh, uh, we're not quite that fancy. I want... Yeah, there we go. We're going to have a glass of water. Uh, we, they, we have cereal. We like cereal. Um, black and catfish. This is, the, this is the fanciest arcade you've ever been to. A <laughs> cup of ramen. Oh, here we go. Pancakes. Yes, I like pancakes. Yes. Show me. thing of pancakes, please. Buford, you don't want to eat? You want to uh, just, uh... Who's this guy? Oh, that's right. Adam is here. Adam in his knight costume. Where's Buford? Where'd you go? Oh, he's... Make uh, <laughs> yourself at home, Buford. <laughs> All right. How are those? Are, is that a pancake? That's not a pancake. <laughs> Chef? Uh, waiter? <laughs> it's not a pancake. Apparently it's okay. Maybe where these guys come from, pancakes are in the shape of tacos. I've been out of town for like, four years. I've been out of town. And the only food I've been eating has been made by Sebastian. Sebastian, the, uh, the dorm cook guy. He does make a mean pancake, though. So I thought I knew what a pancake was. Apparently I did. Apparently I've been all wrong my whole life. All right. You're a little bit hungry, too. Yeah, well, you probably should eat something. I'd get you a, a taco, too, but... I don't know if I order a taco. Okay, so, well, you know what? To end the day, we need to play Pimp Viking 3D game. Because... How can you resist a name like Pimp Viking? Yeah, I'm done. Peter, stop staring at me. No, money is draining fast, especially with this dang expensive arcade. Why am I paying like $12 an hour or something? Silencer. He's sleep at night. Charging his couch. Yes, Rudy. Oh, apparently I lost. Oh, don't. Alright, well, all my money is going away by doing this, so we're gonna go home. We have we had a nice dinner. Time to leave. You know what? Let's go. Who's this? Oh, Dominic. We know Dominic. Let's go grab those fireflies. And then we're getting out of here. Let's see what Adam ordered here. Did he order pancakes too? Pancake taco? Oh, no. He had uh, a hamburger. <laughs> Alright, yes. Grab those fireflies. This was This is what we did before we left town. This, in fact, before we left town, this is the only thing you could do in town. Catch fireflies. Catch fireflies and go camping. But now that we're back, there's like a booming town. 33 people live here. Oh, it's sad. We can never caught them before either. All right. Mr. Nook, let's... Is somebody calling you? Is that your phone? It is your phone. Hey, answer your phone. Who is it? Answer. Who's calling you? Is it somebody from college? Oh, you? No, I don't talk to cows. Go home. I didn't talk to you when I was in college. I don't talk to you now. Come on, Buford. Let's go. All right. Hop on in. Can you open that door? Yeah. You can spend $11,000 on a car. It should have auto cat doors. So I think we're going to put a cut in this uh, this first episode of our new uh, Sims series. So thank you for watching. And uh, these will be out on... I'll stick with my usual routine Monday Or not Mondays. Uh, Sundays and Wednesdays. And I'll probably do... I'll do builds on like a separate day. So occasionally when I want to build something, I'll, I'll throw that out there. Um, not... We'll have them as a separate episode and I'll play. So next time, though, 
we will be back with the the Pioneer House. These were our, this was our first family. There are the uh, the farming folks in town, and we'll see. I got a lot of custom content now of farming stuff. I'm eager to try that out. Let's see what we got here. Let's try uh, look at a little bit of it. Oh, this one. So we've got um, yeah, like peanuts. Yes, we can grow peanuts. Peas. What are you? Red onions. Onions. Garlic. Honeydew. Yes, we have all kinds of uh, new plants that we can we can throw out there. I think I have something else. I have I have more. Oh right, I have like a chicken coop I can get. Yes, so that'll be awesome. We'll try it next time. So, anyways, thank you for watching. And it looks like Crystal decided to uh, make herself at home here. Thanks for watching, and uh, I will see you next time.